Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to be testing out some of these Pixie On The Glow blush sticks. So I got these actually as PR in the mail, but I am not sponsored in any way to film this video. I just did a poll on my Instagram to see if you guys would wanna see a dedicated video on these little blush sticks. And the majority of you guys said that you would like to see a video just dedicated to these blushes. So I'm excited to try them out for you guys for the first time on camera. So I did think that these were new, but I actually checked online and I think that they came out in 2020, towards like the end of 2020. So I'm not sure exactly, but these these are new to me because I've never tried them before so I've been so into blush lately if you guys watch my channel you will see I'm all into blush so I've actually been more also into the cream blushes so when I saw these beautiful little blush sticks over here I was super excited and as you guys can see I have my full face on but no blush just some bronzer so I will be swatching these for you guys and showing them on my cheeks so I believe that they only have these three shades there's Juicy, here's like the coral. Then you have this beautiful, almost like rosy, blue tone pink shade, Fleur. Then you have like this brighter ruby shade, so it's kind of like a nice rich pinky red. So it says that these are tinted moisture sticks, and it also says that you can use them on your cheeks and on your lips, so that is a very interesting, and I love like a multi-purpose product, so that is already great. You can see these are the little sticks here, and they're really cute. They're like a nice sturdy plastic, and you just open it like this, and there's like a little protective seal, and you just take the lid off, and you can twist it, and more product will come out. So these retail for $18 each, and you get quite a bit of product in these containers here. It says that you get 19 grams in each little container, so you're getting quite a bit of product. And of course, cheek and like lip products always last forever as it is, so. And now I will swatch them on the back of my hand so you guys can see the shades before I put them on my cheeks. So this one over here is Ruby. This one over there is Fleur. that one over there is juicy. Okay, so I'm probably gonna end up blending all three on my cheeks, but first I'm gonna start with this lightest one. This one is called Fleur, and it is their really nice like baby doll, kind of more on the blue tone pink side. So I think I'm just gonna like directly apply it to my face. And I'm just gonna like pounce it on. I feel like it's like made to just like easily just like swipe on and then you can blend it with your fingers or with a brush. As you guys can see, I'm kind of just like starting towards the apple and bringing it further up towards the outer corner of my eye and like my temples. Uh, and it's like very natural and super moisturizing. As you guys can probably see on camera, you can definitely see how like moisturized and glowing it looks. There is no like chunky glitters at all in here. It just seems to just be really like naturally moisturizing, which is very, very nice. And I'm just gonna use this Morphe JH05 brush just to kind of blend it in. And I'm just like pouncing it. So that light pink just added like the perfect, like natural, like flushed, pinched kind of look to the cheeks. It's definitely, if you're more fair, then that would be a beautiful color. But I do wanna try the other two shades as well. So on the other side, I'm gonna first place this one here. This one is like their orangey kind of coral shade and that shade is called Juicy. So I'm just gonna swipe it on like I did to the other side. Honestly, it glides on so nice. Like, look at that, guys. You can see it's like a sheen, but it does like settle on your face really nicely. Wow. <laughs> so then I'm gonna go back in with that brush, just like pounce it in. Wow, that is like 
so glowy as you guys can see like my cheeks are shining but there's no like chunky glitter so it's just like super moisturizing and I feel like this would be like amazing on like a beach day if you just want to add like a little bit of color to your cheeks so you can just like put some of that on and you'll just be like glowing with some nice luminous color to your face so I love that juicy it's really nice if you guys can tell the difference that was the more pinky one and this has more of the orange coral tones to it so that is really beautiful and there is ruby which is like the nice almost like fuchsia pink red kind of shade and I'm just gonna add that one to this side where we had the lighter pink I'm just adding like a touch Okay, so that is the ruby shade blended in and I really love that because it almost looks like you just got like a little bit of a suntan Gives you that kind of like sun-kissed look So that looked really nice paired with the pink one and of course I think it would look nice with the orangey side So I think I'm gonna like mix the ruby with that side just to like make things even out And then I will come back and give you guys my final opinion Okay, so I pretty much like blended all three of those blushes together just to make sure that both of my cheeks look the same in the end. So and now the cheeks are done and I feel like I really, really love this product. I've honestly never tried anything like it because all of like the cream blushes that I've used just kind of settle to be like more of a matte or satin finish. And as you guys can tell, this is like you're literally glowing, but you do not have any chunky glitters visible on your face at all. So there is no glitter at all in this product. It is just like the most beautiful moisturizing base. And I really, really love it. They do say that you can actually use it on your lips as well. So I'm gonna just wipe off whatever gloss that I have. And I'm gonna try that for you guys on camera. So I'm using the lightest one here. This one is Fuller. And I'm just like taking it directly on my lips. Of course you could use like a brush or something, but I don't have one here. So I'm just like directly applying it. Then I'm just gonna use my fingertips to wipe it and like blend it in. So I'm just kind of blending it in with my fingers patting it in a bit. So that's really, really pretty. It kind of just leaves like a nice stain. So I'm also gonna take the darkest one, Ruby. And I'm just gonna use my fingers and just pat it on. I'm just like pouncing that color in. And as you can see, it's really moisturizing. It's not like shiny on the lips, but it feels like it's kind of like a tinted moisturizing, almost like chapstick kind of product on the lips. And as you guys can see, it just leaves like a nice stain. So I do think that that's super pretty. As you guys can see, it just gives you like that glow from within and the color is just kind of like melted into my skin and it looked really, really natural. It's definitely buildable, but you could totally make it even more sheer and more natural. It just depends on your liking, but I love it. I think this is like the perfect summer product, especially when you don't want to wear like too much heavy makeup. This honestly just like sits on the skin so beautifully. It doesn't even look like you're wearing makeup. Honestly, it just looks like you have a natural glow and then you get like that sheen to your face, which like totally just like amplifies that look and just makes you honestly look like you have a beautiful summer glow and a tan. And I just love this product. I'm so impressed. Pressed. It's beautiful on the lips and I love how it's like multi-purpose and just love it, love it, love it. And I will be using it a lot this summer. I already know. So definitely get a thumbs up for me and let me know if you guys like these types of videos where I just do like a dedicated kind of like first impressions. And if you let me know if you guys want to see more like drugstore makeup or just kind of anything you would like me to film for you guys, leave that in the comment section. I would love to know. So if you guys like this video, then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!